A new brothel's woman vowed to make a change after the unthinkable happened. She caught a man taking private pictures of her in public. Today, it looks like a change in Texas law could be on the way. Myra Arthur reports multiple bills could finally outlaw an incredible violation of privacy. Haley Powell can't believe it's nearly been a year since a shopping trip changed her life. I felt hands touching my upper thighs and I turned around and it, there was a man dressed as a woman with his arm up my dress recording me. This cell phone video shows bystanders tackling the man. And the day it happened I thought hey we can put him in jail and he can be penalized for what he did. Turns out that wasn't, that couldn't happen. At the time, Texas law could not protect Powell, in large part because the photos were taken in public. Eventually, that law was declared unconstitutional. Powell has pushed to change Texas law, even testifying in Austin. Now, at least four bills filed this legislative session would criminalize improper photography, no matter where it happens. Senator Jose Menendez, the author of one of those bills, cites even more examples here in Bear County. A man uh, lent, kneeled down acting like he was tying his shoes while he was actually filming up in the grocery store up a lady's skirt. State Senator Donna Campbell filed similar legislation and in the House, Representatives Rodney Anderson of Dallas and Doug Miller of New Braunfels have also authored bills. Powell hopes any one of them will become law. It's been a year-long battle, but I'm really excited to see um, that the next time he does it because I have great faith that he's still out there doing this. Um, he will be prosecuted and he'll face the, face the consequences. Myra Arthur, KSAT 12 News. A courageous young woman for sure. Menendez's bill was heard in a public hearing today in Austin and will be put up for a vote at a later date. You can follow the progress of each improper photography bill filed by using the links on KSAT.com. Just click on this story.